hello everyone welcome to the channel in this video guys let me show you the error first if I want to open the YouTube or any other website I'm getting the issue the site can't be reached so I have made couple of videos on this topics but in this video I'm going to show how to resolve this issue completely with the new steps as you can see here the Wi-Fi is connected here but still there is no issue so first of all you need to check the connectivity inside our system simply type at the ping command 8.8.8.8 .8 and hit enter once it is re reaching to the destination it means that there is no hardware issue on your system even you can try with this command 1.1.1 .1 this is the command to check the hardware NIC card on your system it is rep replying perfectly if there is no issue with my internet as well as with my NIC card it means the issue with my setting and I'm not able to open the site here so first of all guys what you need to do is you need to open the control panel from here and in here look for the category wise select here the large icons once you have selected here the large icons you need to go to the internet options internet options this option now once you open that you need to go to the advanced option and simply restore the system setting if something has wrong you have made something wrong on your system so this setting will restore all the settings okay and once you go to this tab so go to the security tab also restore all the zone to defaults apply this also and look for the connections and go to LAN settings and make sure there is no manual proxy on it just select the automatic untick this option proxy one click on apply and click on ok uh, once you have set up this setting guys most of the issues should be fixed by applying this method since we have restored our system to default settings but if you have still issue the site can't be reached error and if the some websites are working or some websites are not working so you can see here this is working but this is not working so how to fix this issue let's move on to the next method in the next method we will use the cloudflare dns as well as the google dns you need to open the run command here and simply type her ncpa.cpl and hit ok once you hit ok go to the connected Wi-Fi network here ok this option right click on it and go to its properties go to the internet protocol version 4 go to its properties and go to the DNS setting and type her 8.8.8.8 and in the alternative 8.8.4.4 this is the google dns click on apply click no close and once just disable it now re-enable this this will refresh the setting ok try to connect with uh, now let me go to the same website now let's see if the issue is fixed or not as you can see here still issue is still not fixed guys so we can use the cloud DNS here as well cloudflare DNS let's see okay yeah 
it has started working guys you can see here for some time after some time it has started working but if your issue is still not fixed guys what you need to do is you can use here the cloud DNS as well here instead of 8.8.8 .8 type here 1.1.1.1 just alternate DNS don't required apply ok now let me refresh it this should also work you can see here this is even working faster see this should also fix your issue we have changed the two DNS here the first one is Google and the second one is Cloudflare DNS open DNS okay if you have still issue guys your issue is still not resolved that you can go ahead with a network reset in our system type for network reset and click on restart and click on yes option once you click on yes option all the saved setting will be deleted you have to re-enter your Wi-Fi password in your system after restart your system and this will fix the issue if you have still issue guys just open the CMD as admin run as admin and type here some commands here ipconfig space forward slash flush DNS this will flush the DNS cache ok ipconfig space flush DNS ok next command net sh winshock space reset this command will reset all the socket added inside your system and also you need to open any browser which you are using currently go to three dots then look for settings and inside the setting guys look for the search engine and make sure the search engine is Google Chrome if anyone is other you have chosen it might get the issue as well so choose here the Google Chrome set as default and once you have done the setting guys your issue should be fixed if the issue is related to browser even you can re reset the Google Chrome as well on our system and this will restore the setting to the original defaults so these are the fixes to fix this issue guys I hope this video helps if yes then hit like subscribe and share thank you thanks for watching